get there. Hi guys, so it's been quite a while since I've actually done a video on this channel. Um, but, good news, I've actually got a review for you guys today. Um, I, I know what it, obviously know what it is, but I've never seen it. It's going to be first time live sort of review of what's in the box. So, let's get going. And nothing else in the box apart from the address which you don't need to see so this is the box that it comes with Let's open it up. So let's switch it down. Mm. So we turn that there for the video. Seasmont. If I'm pronouncing that correctly, apologise if I am not. And then a nice leather box. Small instruction manual or information manual about the watch. And it sits in a nice little little pocket hidden away at the bottom, which is quite nice. And then obviously you've got this cloth just to keep the leather box nice. So we'll just put that away for now. Here we have it. Seismont or Seismont. Can you guess what it is yet? Can you guess what it is yet? Yes, it's a watch. lens cloth just to sort of clean the glass uh, the watch itself um, was made with strong stainless steel and the glass on the front is made from a, from sapphire glass which is supposed to be scratch resistant which to be honest with you for me is is ideal and the reason for not like I would wear it for for work because I work in sort of construction building um, so obviously I wouldn't be wearing this for that definitely definitely not um, so this is it Can you see it's got a focus you see it there so let's have a look before before we do anything I shall take this off which is just my smart watch <clears throat> so we'll just put that to, to one side there and this is the watch Trying to be careful. So it's yeah. I've, do you know what it is? I used to have a watch that had these clasps on, and it just makes taking the watch on and off like a lot, a lot easy. Um, so it's like a deployment clutch, um, and it, it is quite strong. If I just sort of 
give that a pull with my finger. So there's the clasp. It's not coming off. Two little buttons on the side, releases it. So that's that's staying on your wrist, no matter what. Uh, so we'll just open that up. I will take this little bit of card out here. I'm just going to leave the plastic on um, the strap for now, just so it doesn't get damaged, and we'll see if it see if it fits. Big hands. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. I mean, I've got big, big hands. And it fits on there nice and snug. Just a little bit of room. A little bit of sort of wiggle room. But it's not overly tight. Oh, look at that. Absolutely stunning. Let me put my little smartwatch to shame. That, that can do for work. So, this watch here, oh, I'll just take the back off. <clears throat> it's got sort of a, a skeleton dial, so you can see like all the mechanics inside of the watch, which I absolutely love. I don't know if I hold that up. Let's see if I can get it to focus. Focus. You see that? So you can see all the the mechanics of the watch behind, uh, sort of how it works, and it's absolutely stunning. I mean, it's me mesmerising. You could actually just sort of sit and sit and watch it for hours. Sorry, I'm just taking it all in. Uh, yeah, so the watch itself uh, was designed in Denmark. Um, comes in an absolutely beautiful leather uh, box with the sort of the pad for the watch to sit in and it sits in the little hole in the box nice and snug so when it's not in use keep it in the box uh, and it's not going to get damaged uh, the watch itself that I've got here um, is sort of black I would say black and grey the watch, the whole watch itself, is black, but the mechanics inside the watch is grey. Uh, and like I say, it, on the on the front of the watch, it's got the the sapphire glass. Um, so hopefully that should stay quite pro quite protected. Uh, especially if you sort of if, if watches that easily easily knocked, easily sort of easily scratched. So so the case width is forty four millimeter. And the case depth is 12 millimeter. The sort of the watch, the watch, the strap width is 2.2 centimeters, and the length is 18 centimeters long. Uh, obviously, if you've got smaller wrists, and obviously the links can be taken out. Uh, it's actually water resistant as well, um, and the weight of it is 157 grams. It isn't. Well, it's, it has got a bit of weight of it. Um, it, but it's not overly heavy um, so when I was talking about the links so the max wrist size for this is 19.5 centimeters which I would say what mine is because it was quite snug um, but the minimum wrist size that you can go to with taking the links out is 13.2 centimeters um, so it does go down down quite a way so just it's slightly heavier. This is the Samsung, the original Samsung Galaxy Watch. I'm just, I don't have obviously the details of that that for, for weight, but yeah, it's, it's it is a little bit heavier than the smartwatch. But you're definitely going to be standing out from the crowd with this watch, standing there because you've got the sort of the the black face with silver and sort of grey mechanics inside. And then you've got this lovely gold or copper um, wheel that's obviously spinning for the for the for the for the, for the watch. And my goodness, does it not stand out? It is absolutely beautiful. And do you know what? Another good thing about it is, and I've only actually just realised this just because my finger was behind it. The whole watch is actually 
see through, which I know it's going to be hard to see on here. Yeah. But if I put my finger behind, you might be able to just see my finger running behind the watch. So the back of the watch there is just a see through as well. Stunning, absolutely stunning. So, I'll put the watch bar on again. Quick clasp, yeah, strong. That's not coming off. What does it look like? To be honest with the, the sort of the customer service side of things as well, even the shipping, I think it took about a week. Uh, to be delivered uh, and that was only because well I'm saying a week it was probably about five days I think um, but there is other other shipping options oh, why is that keep doing that? there is other shipping options um, as well as other sort of personalization you can do on the website so the website that we're referring to was trend him um, and you can do sort of engraving um, you can do um, sort of personalised prints on the watches, um, different sort of gift packing. There's, def there's a few different options you can do, um, just to make it more personalised. If it was for a gift, Father's Day, Christmas, um, um, and there's a good w wide range of great gifts um, on their website. So make sure you check out all the links and everything will be below. Um, I will leave a link to this exact watch that I am reviewing today on the on the in the description as well as the website. Um, so yeah, so let's see the trend him size mount watch.